Just had the shower in. It's the Moira Elite QT. So, obviously this has got a motor on it and an electrical element so it connects to the cold, low pressure, pumps it through the heater. Really good little showers. So basically this is faulty somewhere so I'll just do some tests on it. I'll test this switch. It's alright. Test the marker switches. Yep, they're fine. Test the heating elements. Yep, they're fine. If there's only one really last thing, it could be wrong. We're going to continue with it aims for this resistance and it's not getting a reading so that solenoid suspect first that's loose well let's do the motor I'm only going to do one side of it that's saying 24 ohms so you want to really match the other side as well the same two connects on the other side, make sure they're 25, 24, 25. Should be pretty much similar. Now I'm going to go between each segment to the next one. 7.3. 10. So that's bad straight away. Seven point five, ten. So they're all over the place. I'd say the motor's wearing as well. The rotor. So new motor, new solenoid on this one. Good little showers, as you can see, easy to test. I'll uh, do the next video. We'll be stripping it down. So if you want to watch that, it'll be up soon. So what do we do? We tested the motor. You want to do both sides, make sure they're equal. Then test between each. I would clean that up first though, get some uh, spray. Just spray it all up, clean it up. Maybe some wire wool. And then test between each segment. They've got to be pretty much the same slot, between six and eight or something like that, ohms. Marker switches, the on off switch, easy to test, and then obviously the solenoid. To replace the solenoid, which this needs, you need to first prise it up a bit. And then I'll just prise off these again. That's it, easy. Just fit your new one, plug it in. These ones I've got a special clip on, so you have to get the correct sort. But other than that, Pretty easy to work on. We've got to do one important test on this earlier, and that's the TCO valve. So I was going to test it for sorry, the TCO temperature cutout or thermal cutout. So that's testing for continuity, that's so that's good. If that trips it cuts the power to your element, so pretty important test. <laughs> 